Hi, it's Tessa and I'm here with a exciting unboxing. Well, it's exciting for me. I got a plum paper planner from Etsy. Um, I ordered it way back in January. It takes a couple weeks to come in. I'm so excited! I'm not a planner. I don't plan. I don't write things down. I forget everything and um, I'm, not, I'm just not good at it. I'm not an organized person at all. But I'm so excited to get this planner. So it comes in a box with a bubble wrap. <gasps> Yay! Okay, let me get rid of this box. So it's bubble wrap. <laughs> Here it is. There's just a little... They have a website, but... Um, you have to order on Etsy. I like totally. I'm just so excited. It's so pretty. It looks like this. Um, it's purple with like dandelions or zinnies or something. There's a clear plastic film over the front and the back. It's not very thick, but it is, you know, protective. This is a 2015-2016 calendar because I started it in February because I knew I wasn't going to get it until then. It's the first page. It belongs to, you know, all the tabs are laminated. They're very solid and very nice. Oh, this is so nice. Um, blah, 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 blah. This is a year at a glance. And the next page, that's for 2015-2016. And my calendar starts in February, so there's a blank page there. And then I added note pages. I think it comes with note pages, but I added extra because I like to take notes. Um, I don't know where they put them. Oh, they put them in the back. Okay. So there's a note page in the beginning, and there's note pages at the end of the month. And it, since it starts in February, here's the spread. The Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Um, this is the monthly spread, right? Yeah, it's the month. And then the weekly spread, when you go into the first month, these are all blacked out from the last month. So you have like January 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th, 30th, 31st, and then this starts February 1st. And when you turn the page, I'll get it on to a full page. Let me just turn it to the current week. Okay, so it's February 16th. So here's the current spread. Let me back up a little bit. Okay, so you have morning, afternoon, and evening for each day. And then down here there's a checklist, which I think I might do meal planning. On this side, there's a weekly list and a section for notes on each page. So there's that. And then that's it. Then you just go into, there's my note pages in the back that I ordered extra. Once you get to the end of the year, let's see what's in the end of the year. It stops on January 20th to 16th. Mine does because I ordered extra. Let me get back. Past my notes. Okay, so after my note page in the back, there's a blank page for whatever without any lines. There's a couple of them. And then you get to a special date section where you can write down birthdays or anniversaries or special holidays, anything like that. After that, there's a contacts page. And then this is a list of all the holidays, the national recognized holidays, and the dates for the next three years. This paper is very smooth. And then in the back, there is a folder page. It says for keeps. And the cover, again. So that is my planner, it's so nice. And I had ordered, this is, I'm gonna do a video on my um, things, you know, my planner supplies or whatever. But I had this tucked away because I ordered this pen and um, folder folder thing from an Etsy shop called Southern Planner Glam. 
It looks like this. Can you see that? Southern Planner Glam. I'll have to look link it below. And oh, I'm so excited. Let me pull this off of here and I'll show you what it looks like on my planner. It's one of those like stretchy things. And it has this bow. And inside the bow there's a tab where you can put a pen. I don't have a do I have a pen here? Handy? Something? Anything? Let's see. We do. Okay, let me put this on my planner. I got the right color. I was so worried that the color wouldn't match, but I got the perfect color. It looks like this. That is so cute. Fits perfect. I got it just for the plum planner. Now, I'm not going to be using... That pen's too thick. I'm not going to be using this pen, but just for the sake of showing you, the pen slides right in like that if you want to, you know, carry a pen with you. Other than that, it's just a flat bow. It's so cute. They did an excellent job with that. that. Again, that is Southern Planner Glam from Etsy. And just briefly, I want to show you the planner I had purchased prior. This is the planner I had purchased from Walmart. It is just a mint green planner is the brand. And I put this strap on here. It's just a headband, and I punched two holes in here and hot glued it so it had its own band on it. This is small compared to, do you see the size difference and how big the rings are, the difference in the size of the ring? Here is the problem. Look how thick this is. It's like the second month of the year, and it's that thick already, and I'm already running out of room to shove stuff in here. There's no way this would last me the whole year for all my planning and decorating. Um, I had my dashboard in here and some like pages of for notes I decorated. Whoa, that <laughs> flew right off of there. You know, I decorated some pages up. Then we're into this was this is February and I have my little note cards and my video stuff that I want to do. And here's my decor. <laughs> the weeks. I like this planner. This is this week. This is my, I made this uh, bookmark. And I have a list of things I'm waiting for in the mail. So that's how that's decorated. It's a nice little planner, don't get me wrong, but for the things that I wanted to put in here, it was just too small. I'm still going to use this though. I think I'm going to use this either for YouTube ideas and or working out, like fitness and health. But I'm definitely going to use this for something. I'm not going to let it go to waste. I'll see how it goes as time goes on and how much I enjoy this planner. I don't know if I'm going to put everything in here or some stuff in this planner. Um, I'm not sure yet. Oh, I wanted to show you real quick. I definitely want to play make a bunch of planner videos because I did some cute things. Like in the back, I didn't have a pouch because obviously this doesn't come with a pouch. So I took a, um, well first I made an envelope there. And this is a Ziploc bag that I just decorated with um, washi tape. And I cut the bottom out and I put it in here and now it's like a page and it's just a little pouch. And inside I have washi tape that I put on a card. I'll show you. So I can take washi tape with me on a card. Um, what else do I have in here? I have journaling cards in here. So, I mean, it's just a great little pouch and I'll probably make one for my new planner too. Cause I really like that idea. So yeah, I mean, there were some fun things that I tried out in here and it was my first planner. So I do want to use it some more. And I will do a video on my planner supplies coming up soon. I'm going to get a page decorated in here and see how it goes. So thanks for watching. I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.